Hi, hello, welcome back. Now let's see page uh, 43, exercise 45. Consider an arithmetic progression with terms a13 equals 64 and a25 equals 28. I want to know a sub 7, 8. Well, again, take a pen, your pencil, and do the math. Uh, it's not difficult. Actually, you, we are starting to make a kind of review and we're going to return to some simpler problems, okay? So please take your time, take your pencil and do the math, okay? It's very important. This one is very easy, okay? Um, okay, so uh, pause for a minute and I wait, okay? Okay, I'm going to give you uh, a tip. Well, what is the general idea in here? We have two terms. With those, what can we get? We can get D, right? Remember, once we have AN, it is AB plus N minus B times D. Remember, that one is very important, and that is the one we're going to use in here, that formula. It's very handy. Okay, now, if I haven't done yet, please, just uh, what we're going to do next after we have D. Okay, you have to think like this. Okay, now we're going to have D because AN it is going to be this one, AB it is going to be this one. Okay, N minus B is going to be 25 minus 13, which is 12. So we can find D. Once we find D, what are we going to do? Okay, I want you to think. I just don't want you to just follow my reasoning. I just want to th you to think. Okay, think for a minute in here. We have D. Okay. Now, since we have D, what are we going to do now? Well, what can we do? Maybe with that D, knowing D and knowing a term, we can know every single term on that sequence. Okay. And that's going to be our path. Okay. So, let's just start to uh, plug in numbers. Uh, AM, it is going to be a25 is going to be A13 plus 25 minus 13 times D. Um, now I'm going to do uh, at once, okay? I'm going to take A13 to the left and I'm going to divide by 12 already. And this is going to be D. D is going to be A25, which is 28 minus 64 divided by 25 minus 13 okay and that is going to be minus 36 divided by 12 okay yes 4 with 2 6 30 60 yeah and this is going to be minus 3 okay that means that our D it is minus 3 wonderful that is going to be our D Knowing D, we can know, knowing D and knowing any term on our sequence, we can know everybody, okay? Uh, now let's get A78, it is going to be, I can choose for instance, A25 plus 78 minus 25 times minus 3, okay? It is our common difference. If we just do the math, okay, A78, it is going to be 28, okay, uh, this is going to be a positive with a negative, this is going to be a negative, okay, so negative 3 times, in here we're going to have 53, and in the end we're going to have negative 131, so this is going to be our A78. Very straightforward, right? This one, it's not difficult at all. Okay, just that. Simple one, just refresh our memory. Okay? 